Hello everyone and thanks for tuning back in. I hope you're doing all fine. So before we start as usual, I'm not a financial advisor and all the content and information in this video is my own opinion and my own market observation. So let's dive here into the daily chart. Uh, this morning we had a nice pump here to retest the 8.4K line and we got again rejected. You can see that the correction is right now happening. So as long as we stay in this area here it's going to be very bullish and very likely that we can break it only if we're going back down to retest the 20 daily or 50 daily so maybe here at the 6.7 k or uh, 6200 dollar line there i think if we go to retest this area for the moment uh, to break the 8.4k is quite unlikely but as long as we stay in this higher region here i think it's very possible that we're gonna break the 8.4k with this move and then uh, sh uh, shoot directly straight up here to uh, 9500 to the next uh, resistance line i think that that is very likely and um, we have to keep an eye here on the price if we have a bigger rejection back down here uh, to retest here the main support at around 6k all the 6k area then maybe um, it's gonna take a bit more time till we can break this line over here but uh, in this moment as I record this video it looks quite uh, nice and uh, we probably should uh, have a, another retest uh, later on here in the in the one hour chart you see that the stochastic and the RSI are cooling down so it's quite healthy that we have this uh, this cool off right now uh, let's hope that the rsi goes again above 50 so this will be again bullish but um such a cool off is uh, is is very healthy for the price as you can see also here when we cool down the stochastic and the rsi down here we had enough momentum to break the previous high so i believe that in the next move if we see here a, a bigger correction uh, let's say to this uh, point here the 7600 um, we cannot go lower than this point over here otherwise we will have a, a lower high but if we stay above this line here i think with the next move we will break the 8500 uh, line let's see uh, let's go here to the four hour uh, four hours still above 50 the rsi stochastic oversold so here it looks quite nice also this pink line gives us support here still so this is also very bullish everything looks very very nice and also the altcoins right now are picking up every day it's such a nice feeling that when you wake up in the morning and you know that your portfolio is going uh, higher and higher so after one year of bear market when you woke up every morning and you just was uh, crazy to see the the portfolio going lower and lower um, last year we had like to put our uh, money into into something to an asset uh, doesn't matter if bitcoin or any alts or fiat where you would lose the less money but it looks like that we entered the bull market and i think right now you can wake up every morning and you see gains over gains over gains and it's just a matter of where you put the money to have the most gains and if you put some bitcoin in altcoins you would have now already um doing some profits because uh, the alts are picking up and it especially ethereum and ripple looks very very um nice and they are performing very well and i think if we can break also the 8500 line uh, they these alts here will uh, have even better performance in in my opinion but of course if we get rejected and we go back down to the 6k area although these alts will bleed a lot even more than bitcoin so all these gains we had right now would would have been lost but let's see the thing is that right now uh, you see after this pump this morning a uh, lot of shorts got liquidated or stopped out so we have a very very um it's almost a half of the shorts uh, uh, are out so you can see we are at around 17 thousand and the longs are still here with 25 thousand so when we have something like this it is very possible that we see some wicks or pushes to the downside now to liquidate also the longs here because we have too many longs compared to shorts but um, 
maybe for the next couple of hours we can see some more weeks to the downside but i think we will recover immediately so probably also at that point the shorts uh, will uh, pick up again and uh, rise again here i think this is just temporarily because we just had this uh, pump and dump right now this happened just in a couple of uh, minutes i think let's go to the 30 minutes uh yeah you can see here where did we had here almost 8500 and then we dropped down to 7600 i mean this is almost thousand dollar of difference also this morning here 80 8400 down to uh, 7800 so when we have these big uh, pushes to the upside we have also push big pushes to the downside so you should be prepared for this and not uh, be scared when you see everything in red and going down again such as here or here because in a bull market these dips should make you buy and not sell so be aware to not sell and then the price um, moonshot again to the upside and you're out of the game so that's why i i don't even look uh, for a sell point right now i just let it go and you know my targets around uh 13 000 for this move before I would consider to take some little profits out, just some little ones to have some fiat uh, on the sideline in case that we gonna go back down and retest the 6K area or any support down here. Because as you know, I mentioned it yesterday, we have still a huge uh, futures gap here uh, in the daily chart. Uh, and this one goes down to 60, 300 so i believe if we go so low we will also retest the 6k line down here so if i would take some profits out i would definitely uh, put it in again here at the 6k uh, line i don't believe that we we will see again prices uh, below 6k in the in the close future um, unless of course uh, from up here we're gonna go straight back down and then maybe it is possible but um, uh, right now it looks like the price feels very comfortable at this uh, price range we didn't even have a major wick or retest of any of these supports down here so that's why i think the 8500 line will be broken as soon as we have another attempt to break to the upside all right guys with that said i'm gonna wrap it up and we see us all in the next one. Bye.